The first female saint of Canada was canonized in 1982, Saint Marguerite Bourgeois. She was born in 1620 in Troyes, France, and was orphaned at the age of 19. While attending a procession in honor of Our Lady of the Rosary on October 7, 1640, Marguerite found herself so moved and so changed that in that very moment, she decided to discern her specific vocation. She aspired to be an extern of the Congregation of Troyes, whose apostolate included teaching poor children in different districts of their town. But when she learned of the foundation of Ville-Marie, now Old Montreal, Canada, she volunteered to be a teacher for the children of the settlers there. Their delegation arrived on the 16th of November, 1653, and some years later, she founded Montreal's first school. Marguerite would go back and forth to France, recruiting female teachers to her school. And these teachers eventually became her religious sisters. Now, it is interesting to note that she was not only a pioneer in the education sector, but also the founder of one of the first uncloistered and apostolic religious communities, something deemed unthinkable in the 1600s. When she defended their proposed way of life, she cited that it was patterned after that of Our Lady, who herself had always been apostolic. The Congregation of Notre Dame of Montreal received its civil char charter in 1671 and its canonical approbation in 1676. The approval of its constitutions came later in 1698. Marguerite was popular among Ville-Marie settlers because of her works for the church and the community, which showed her love for God and neighbor. In fact, she was so beloved that they used to either call her Mother or Saint Marguerite, even before she was canonized. Saint Marguerite Bourgeois, pray for us. <laughs>